to Jenny's Kitchen. Today in Jenny's Kitchen, I am going to make a three immune system building um, supplements. Okay, so the first one I'm going to do, I need three cloves of garlic and a small onion, two ounces of ginger, a quarter cup of lemon juice quarter cup also of raw honey and um, this is a video I got since corona came around from a doctor so I've been doing that since that time I take I take this um, three tables three teaspoon rather each day and that helps to clear your lungs so I've been doing that since March. So just in case you would like to have something to help you out, um, I'm going to share this with you today. Okay. So I'll be blending in this cup here. So I am going to put in my ginger. Also going to put in my garlic. And I'm going to cut the onion a little bit. Quarter cup of honey. Okay, and the doctor that sent this video out says it's not just for the flu or the corona also if you have asthma it's good to clear your lungs and I've been giving this to my daughter since that time and it is really helping her because she has mild asthma okay So the recipe also calls for one eighth cayenne pepper, but I cannot put one eighth of cayenne pepper because it really burns my stomach. So I'll just put a little, a little dash, not too much, just a little dash. Okay. And I also like to put another juice with it, but let me blend this first. shaking it to get the honey mix mixed in okay so I'm just gonna put I'm gonna put some orange juice okay this quarter. so that's half a cup of orange juice
Nice. So, I'm storing it in this glass bottle. store it in my fridge okay and I take three teaspoon according to the doctor three teaspoon is good to clear your lungs okay so don't wait until you catch COVID to start using it okay okay so my next um, drink immune system building drink I am going to make I'm going to be using olive vera and I already cut the size and I soak it in water for a little bit to get that yellow toxin thing that runs from it already. I rinse that off already and I catch some more water. So I'm gonna pour this water off. Now, and I am going to peel my olive vera. Okay. you can rub it on also you can also rub it in your hair you can use it to wash your hair but I like to put it on my face um, and let it dry and go sleep overnight and if you have burn if you get a burn in the kitchen you can also use it to rub on the burn and it will heal it very quickly I know a lot of people don't like aloe vera. They don't like the taste, the taste of it. They said it is bitter, but I think when it's bitter is when you um, let the skin get in whatever you're doing, even though the bitterness is also good for you. Okay. Also, when you eat aloe vera, or you make a drink with it if you're someone that is easily constipated you can use it it will help you to go to the bathroom very easy freely right it cleanses and build your body at the same time Okay, so I am going to um, cut this grapefruit because I'm going to use it. I'm checking for any seeds that might be in here. Yes, there are seeds.
beets in there. I started peeling it already, so let me just finish up. just so you can know if you don't know that the beads really stain your hands so if you're one of those people who don't want your hands to get stained you probably will need a glove you need gloves to put on okay need to put on your gloves okay all right so I am trying to do this in here but I also want to put some carrots and I don't think everything can hold in here but let me try let me pour this water off try to see if the carrots can hold in here.
Okay, it is finished. Okay, so this is nice and thick. I'm not going to taste this as yet because I am going to add some pineapple juice to it because it is very thick as you can see it's thick and I just need to have a different consistency okay so I probably put about half of this going to pour about half of this in this so I could get to wash it out. Oh. Wow, it doesn't hold so much. All right, let me just cover this and then shake it around. Um, I'm going to put some more pineapple drink and I think I'm gonna just squeeze out a little bit more honey maybe a tablespoon or so Okay, I think this is good. Okay, so if you notice, I did not strain this drink. So I have the roughage in here also. And the roughage is a very good thing to have also because it also helps you um, to go to the bathroom more freely. Okay, so I would, I will be drinking this drink. I'll take probably a week to finish this. Or maybe less because I'm not going to drink a pile of this okay it's like a medicine it is a medicine so it's not a regular drink that you would just drink a big glass and drink another big glass no but I will let this last for about a week all right so with that said I am going to make the other drink but let me cover this this right here for now get this clean ok 
Okay, so my next drink, I'm also going to put olive vera in there. And I'm just going to drop this in there. I'm also going to just drop this in there. I'm not going to put that piece in there. And I'll be using an apple. I already cut it in four. I'm just going to cut it a little smaller. Okay, so I'm just going to blend this first before I try to add anything else to it. is nice and thick it's more like a smoothie because of the banana and the um, olive vera mm. this tastes really really good wow it tastes really good but I am going to add the rest of this pineapple to it so the body of it won't be so thick okay Tastes really nice. The banana gave it a very nice flavor. Wow. I don't have to blend it. I could just shake it, but let me just put it on for a little bit. some ice in there and crush it and I think if you have it cool it will be much more tastier but it's all up to you okay so I'm gonna store my drink in this um, glass bottle and yes I'm going to taste it this is my glass This is good. This is really good. Wow. Mm. 
this is very good. I am loving it. And the reason why I'm loving it so much, I did not put um, this piece in there, this little piece of aloe vera with the skin on. If I did, it would be very bitter. But I chose not to because this one already has um, a little piece of it and tasting. it's tasting a little bitterish. Okay. So guys, here are my three different immune system building drink. Remember, these two has um, aloe vera. So you can mix your aloe vera with whatever fruit you would like to mix it with. Or if you want to just have straight aloe vera, you know, it's up to you and this this one is my flu shot so i will put the description the ingredients i'm sorry i will put the ingredients down into the description box so if you have interest in trying any of these drink you could go ahead and do so and help yourself out okay because we all have to learn to help ourselves to take care of ourselves I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now. Stay safe. God bless you.